timing tonight. Wow, look at that camera shoot, uh, yeah. shaking. Let's take this up full right away. This is uh, actually unbelievable in the past uh, 10 minutes. Uh, I was outside, uh, you know, uh, it was, I knew the front was getting close. At 9.51, we had, uh, I mean, this building's shaking right now. Literally, the, the lights are moving over there. Gusting over 50 miles per hour would be my estimate. At the airport, a gust of 48, our camera's having some difficulty. A brief burst of rain, now we have the snow. Look at this. This is right now in Albany. The Arctic front came in so quick. You can see our camera out on the uh, weather deck is shaking as well. Let's take a look up at Malta. Not quite as windy here. So it's right now it's much worse in Albany as the Arctic air is, uh, is pouring in. Uh, hard to believe this afternoon, 56, and at 10 o'clock tonight, in the 30s, winds gusting to 50, and it's snowing. It changed to snow so quickly. Now, the radar is having a hard time. We know this is snow everywhere, basically west of Albany. So this is going to be a burst of snow for about an hour as it comes on through. And in some cases, it could be heavy. And with the wind, it could reduce visibilities quite a bit and cause the roads to uh, ice up. So for the next one to three hours, snow showers and squalls. A quick inch or two could fall in a few places. Very windy, gusting 50 miles per hour. Watch for the flash freeze. The temperature's dropping rapidly. Anything wet or slushy will turn to ice, and it will still be slippery in the morning. Now, the temperature in Albany, down to 38. We've dropped about 5 degrees in 5 minutes. I'm serious, 5 minutes. 31 in Cobleskill, 32 in Johnstown, still mild to the east, so it will take another hour for that ar Arctic front to move into the Berkshires. Here it is, and behind it, that line of rain quickly changing to snow and some snow squalls. Be careful. Much more coming up later in the newscast. John?